Hi, welcome to my new series where I compare Overwatch 1 and 2 designs. This first episode will be about the very mascot of Overwatch, Tracer. Let's get started. Being the mascot, Tracer has a very iconic design. She has bright yellow and orange running leggings that draw attention to her legs as she's a very mobile character, worn down and kind of muddied up shoes to show that they've been used quite a bit, goggles to protect her eyes, and a pilot's or bomber's jacket to allude to the fact that she used to be a pilot. Not to mention the Chronal Accelerator is the very centerpiece of her design, which signifies its importance as it allows Tracer to blink and recall. The design gets the message across of what she as a character and her abilities are about, while also staying within the realm of believability that this may actually be something someone would wear within the Overwatch universe. Overall, it's a fantastic, iconic design. Overwatch 2, on the other hand, has a sleeker look to it overall. The leggings and shoes are mostly the same, except the grime and dirt on both of them are gone, the slots for her pistols on her forearm are a lot smaller, and her chronal accelerator is also a good bit smaller, and the bright blue is contrasted with white instead of that light brown of the jacket, so it kind of draws less attention to itself compared to Overwatch 1's design, which is fine, I guess, but man, did they really have to take away the Amelia Earhart jacket for something a lot more, I don't know, generic? Not to say that her Overwatch 2 design is bad or anything, because really it follows basically the same design formula as the first skin, but it feels like, to me, that a lot of Tracer's personality was lost in the transition to 2 in exchange for making her design sleeker, which isn't a fair trade, in my opinion. Overall, I definitely prefer the Overwatch 1 design. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of my content. More videos in this series will be soon to come.